Good morning, everybody. Orange Jay here with another edition of Friday Night War of the Visions, the weekly auto PvP tournament. Um, it is the fifth version of this, like I just said. They've all gone super awesome. The special rules for today are no units above level 99 and males only. It's a dudes tournament today. It's the Battle of the Bros. We are in our first semifinal match here. We have Ragnar versus LXD92. Um, we are going to do the semifinals, the second semifinals, the third place match, and the finals in this video. Um, the winner gets an Amazon gift card or um, Apple gift card, and we make a donation to Cancer Research in their name. Um, the Church of Eileen supporting the community. Let's get into the fight, though. LXD's Laswell buffs his shield and moves forward. LXD running Laswell, he's running Garvel, and he's running 9S. Now, you might think, wait a second, you just said only level 99 units. That's right. He has his 9S capable of being level 120, but paused him at level 99 just for this tournament. Now, both players actually did this, so we get to see some 9S action. Here's the Assault Field buff, Accuracy up, that could be useful, we'll find out. Um, Ragnar running uh, Garvel, lots of Garvel today, also a 9S at level 99, and running... Uh, who's his third? I didn't see it. We got Azure Sky coming out here from Laswell. Our first damage of the match. Um, Laswell loves uses Limit Break. What kind of damage are we going to get here? 5,100 on Dwayne. That's the other person. It's Dwayne. And Dwayne's in trouble. Garvel walks up. Cheese shot. Dwayne is actually just out of this fight. But Garvel looking for the counterattack here. They're grouped. But Magic Reflex procs. Detonation Blast actually hits nobody. And that's a bad break. Now, what can 9S do? Stun hacking, attack down, magic down, and the stun. Massive debuff there from 9X. Now, Cyclonic Spear, spinning spear from stopwatch right there. Little bit of damage, but LXD in the driver's seat here. Laswell steps up, auto attack, he's out of AP. That might be big. Garvel has AP for days. He's probably looking for a detonation blast. He is big damage onto both. They are both low. Now, Ragnar's Garvel was stunned. What can 9S do? Does 9S have... No, nothing. He gets dodged by Laswell, and that's an oof. Now, LXD's 9S says, Boom, I'm going to do my stun attack again. Early returns on that attack. It's looking strong, in my opinion. Okay? We're getting concentrated Chi Lancer here. Garvel looking to kill Garvel. We'll see. This Garvel's got a lot of work to do if Ragnar's coming back in this thing, and that's not going to cut it. Laswell walks up, drops the Mirror of Equity, and that's it. LXD wins the fight. GG. He will move on to the finals. Awesome. Let's get to our second semifinal match. All right. Our second semifinal match of the day is Leaky Bandit versus Tay. Both players rocking that slot one Dwayne. We've seen a lot of Dwayne in this tournament. We've seen a lot of Garvel. Lots of Laswell. We actually saw a lot of Skull. Um, there's been some Thancred mixed in there. This has been really cool. Um, it's been kind of a throwback to an older meta, and that's really been enjoyable. Okay, so now we've got uh, Leaky Bandit running Garvel. Um, we also have Tay running his Garvel Warrior of Light. And who's the third here? Dwayne. So Dark Bros plus Warrior of Light on one side. And then Leaky Bandit running Thancred plus Dwayne, plus Garvel. So both teams running two dark units, one light unit. You were not allowed to use mono element in this, but two and one was fine. Now, early returns here, both people buffing up, moving forward. There's the slash attack buff, plus the AP buff from Dwayne. Garvel walks up, detonation blast on a two. That's big time damage. Tay's Warrior of Light has tanked him all the way here, but he's tanking with slash resist. So no slash resist and detonation blast. Also no slash resist in jamming thrust. Big time jamming thrust damage there from uh, Garvel. Now what's Dwayne going to do? Magic infuse onto Garvel, get that AP down, and with some nice damage. Here comes a jump from Thancred. That could be good damage here. Oh, and a jump from Dwayne. It's a jumping team. Jump 1, 1600. Jump 2, 5262. Warrior of Light out of the fight, and Leaky Bandit's Garvel moves up, kills Dwayne. It is Garvel versus 3. Cheese shot, it's Garvel versus 2. Can he do it? Garvel, really good unit. But it's a 2v1. There's Dragon's Kin buff from Thancred walking forward. Now, Leaky Bandit's Garvel. Oh, Magic Reflex. That's huge. He Magic Reflexes the Twin Chi Rupture. This Limit Break, not going to do damage. Boom. Dodge it. Now, what can Tay's Garvel do? He's looking. Jamming Thrust onto Thancred. Thancred is 
toast. He is out of this fight. 8,000 damage. It's Garvel on Garvel. Chi shot, 2,600. But Taze Garvel still got a turn left. He turns around, Chi shots, 3,800. The Garvel 1v3 is real. And Tay advances to the finals. GG. Okay, for our third place match, we have Ragnar versus Leaky Bandit. Now, the, um, the way these tournaments work, you get points for winning any match that you win. So playing the third place match, even though there's no prize on the line, there is still ranking points. And there will be some grand finals where anybody with enough ranking points will get to participate. So there's still something on the line for this match. Your elo will go up if you win, if you're familiar with that system. Um, let's see how this one plays out. Okay, Ragnar running 9S, Dwayne, and Garvel. Garvel puts his barrier on and walks forward. And then Garvel puts his barrier on and walks forward because, you know, that's what Garvels do. Dwayne looking for that revitalize with the AP restore. Okay. And then here's 9S. Now, 9S walks forward. He's going shield deployment here. Defense and spirit buff with the protect on himself. Good play. Here's Thancred. Made it all the way to the third place match. I'm proud of my boy Thancred for making it this far. He pops bells. Here's Dwayne with War Maiden's Vitality. Get that slash attack resist up. Okay. Garvel moves forward. Jamming thrust onto Dwayne. 2200 damage. Dwayne lives. Okay. It's the it's Ragnar's Garvel's turn. He's looking for that limit break. He's like, this one ain't getting dodged. He jumps up in the air. Throws the Kamehameha at the ground. 3100 damage with the spirit debuff. Um, useful. Now, Dwayne looking to get some revenge. He's going for the limit break. The cool thing here, this will heal him. So how much of the damage will stick after this limit break? Uh, some of it. He heals for about a thousand after that damage. Now what's 9S going to do? 9S going for the stun attack. 9S going for a buff. He's thinking, he's thinking, we got some lag. Hopefully we don't have a DC. No, we don't. Here we go. 9S walking forward. Neural hacking. So hacking complete. I've never actually seen this in action live. It does some damage. But Garvel's still alive. Thancred going for a jump. Ooh, and here comes another death size. This time, Leaky Bandit's Dwayne goes up in the air, dropping that multi-hit slash attack with the heal. Big damage and a big heal. And then horizontal jump on 9S. We are trading punches. And finally, two people go down. Dwayne and 9S go down. But then the counter detonation blast kills Garvel. So Garvel has been the MVP of this tournament so far. And Thancred unable to get into range. Now, what can Dwayne do with 3 AP? only buff that means garvel's gonna have a chance for another big time aoe attack right here detonation blast kills Dwayne. you guys it's thancred versus garvel there's no way thancred pulls this off right surely not thancred rough divide 1600 damage garvel's like bro i got you punch oh 810 dragon's blade counter attack you're kidding me right here there's no way can thancred 1v1 garvel the day one double cost unit almost keen edge attack does not quite kill him, but he lives! Oh my goodness. Okay, both units, 5 HP. Thancred, 97 AP. He's thinking, he's thinking. Just goes with the auto, just big flex, and Thancred secures the third place match. I think we just confirmed it. Thancred is a better unit than Garvel. You just saw it right here. There's no way you could possibly dispute that. GG third place in the books okay now for the finals of the battle of the boys we got tay versus lxd 92 tay showing off that slot one Dwayne. lxd 92 showing off that slot one laswell winner gets that google play slash apple gift card you know for all of like five dollars or whatever and most importantly we make that donations to Til children's charity research because the church of eileen all about supporting the children um and that's awesome the match is starting. Let's see how this plays out. Can Laswell pull off those clutch dodges and secure first place? Or does the Dark Bros plus Warrior of Light team win the day? Now, LXD, Garvel, Laswell, 2, or I was about to say 2B, 9S. 2B, not in this tournament. I didn't see her at least. Now, there's Chi Barrier from Garvel. He's walking forward. It is Tay's Garvel's turn. I bet you he casts Chi Barrier and walks forward. There it is. And there he goes. Perfect. 9S, looking for some buffs, looking for some buffs. Uh, he's going to go with Assault Field, get the attack and accuracy up. He's like, no dodging today. Warrior of Light, Brave Presence, defense and hate up, moves forward. But Tay's team kind of forced to group here. This could be trouble. Dwayne has found himself overextended in a lot of fights and dying. Um, we'll see what happens here. There's the Illusion buff from Laswell. Lots of evade on the board here. Jamming Thrust onto Warrior of Light, nice damage, about 3,000. Garvel, is he in range for a detonation blast here? He might be. 
Magic Reflex is going to dodge some of it. Detonation Blast, no damage. It's like we've seen it play out exactly that way before. It's 2 beast turn, stun hacking, attack down, magic down, stun. That move, really, really good. Warrior of Light slides forward, stopping strike, no proc on the stop. So, RNG on LXD side early. Laswell, looking for something, probably the limit break. Laswell loves his limit break, here it is. As your sky, it's going to be the pillar of ice, how much damage? That's the question. Warrior of Light takes 1,000, Garvel takes 2. Garvel steps forward. Oh my goodness. Concentrated Chi Lancer onto both people here. This is probably a double kill. Here it comes. There they go. Double kill. It's a 1v3. It's Dwayne versus 3. He goes, he says, 9S, I'm done with you. And then 9S is like, I hack you again because that's what I do. And then Garvel says, boom, I'm just going to punch you out, Dwayne. LXD is your champion of Friday Night Fights number 5. Congratulations, LXD. Thank you to everyone who participated in the tournament. Thank you to everybody in the stream who supported by watching. Um, you guys are awesome. Have a great night, everybody, and I will see you in the next video.